So basically, I'm gonna walk back, come out the corner, proper introduction vibes. Oh, sorry. Scusa mi, scusa mi, signori. I'm in Italy, in Venice right now. This is the home of pizza, one of Italy's most popular dishes. Foods to eat, one of them. And today, we're gonna be cooking pizza. How was that? Okay, your turn. And roll it. We're in Italy today, in Venice to be specific. We're gonna be cooking one of Italy's most popular dishes, which is pizza. Stay tuned. So yeah, let's just take you around the streets of Venice for a little Stay bit. Stay tuned. <laughs> Move out the way, man. We're going to be taking you around the streets of Venice as we shop for our ingredients. Oh, and it appears as though we have a shop right around the corner. I don't know exactly what we need to get. I'm just going to freestyle. If we look at what he's got, we can decide what we want to add on the pizza. So essentially, we want to make it as Italian as possible, but we want to add some of our own flair to it. Welcome to Venice. Looks like we've got a food market right here. See, what are you thinking? What do you want on your pizza? Some veg. Some cherry tomatoes. Onions, onions. Okay, so that's it. Tomatoes, peppers, onions. Sorted. Ciao. Can we have quarter kilo um, cherry tomatoes? I don't even know how much that is, bro. I'm just saying. Let's see. That's it, actually. That's enough. That's enough. And um, two peppers, one red and one yellow, please. Can we get some spinach as well, please? Spinach, uh, just a little bit. Yeah, that's good. There was one more thing that I said. Oh, is, the, is that shallot? Shallot. Just one. Oh, you can't. You have to buy it. What about this one? Oh, why am I still wearing this? This was for the other video. You have card machine. Grazie, so, grazie, signori. All right, so we got some of our toppings. I think we're missing. We want some mushrooms. We want some tuna. And what else do you add on pizza, bro? Oh, we need the flour. Yeah, we need flour and we need yeast. Anyways, at a cop now. I think we just need to buy some flour, some yeast. What else do you tomato need for pizza? Sauce. Tomato sauce. Cheese. We want some tuna. Cheese, yes. And yeah, I think that's all we need. This is no photos. This hey, one. Yeah, bro. The video. Just. We're just gonna have multiple types of cheese. I don't know any of these. <laughs> this looks like Tom and Jerry cheese. Cartoon cheese, bro. There is cheese here. Is this vegan? That's vegan cheese, bro. Trees. Just get some of these and chop them up. I don't know what to get. I'm just gonna ask them. Uh, ciao. Which cheese is good for pizza? None. There. Other side. I'll get some pecorino. 30 pound a kilo. Did you just get told to pick out the most expensive one? Oh, yeah, it is the most expensive one. Oh, I'm getting tourist baited. I didn't realize. Did you have mozzarella? Mozzarella. Mozzarella la trovi. Ah, I did not understand a single word, but she's great at using her hands. Absolutely formidable. She said. <laughs> I was like, I know what you're talking about. Get these two, not so well. And now, what else do we need? Some flour. How do you make this? I don't know. We're gonna find out. Should we just get this one? It says it's 100% Italian. Yeast should be in the same section. Is this yeast? Hey okay, guys, look. Macarons. Look at that. Levieto madre. That means it levitates your mum. We don't even have internet in here, so we can't search up oh, how to say yeast in Italian. Surely this is yeast. Excuse me. Is this yeast? Uh, yes. Oh, okay. What's the word for yeast? Is it levioto? Yes. Okay, levioto. thank you. Uh, oh, olive oil. We need to get a little one though. We're literally leaving tomorrow morning, so we should get this one. We can fill up the plane. <laughs> Shopping complete. Alright guys, shopping trip complete, here we are. We're gonna go make some pizza here in Venice, Italy. View of the canal, it's proof that we're actually not in Shepherd's Bush. Alright, so it's like 7pm now, we just got back home. We're leaving Italy tomorrow, so we're gonna do some more explorations before go heading off to the airport. <sighs> I look tired because I just had a nap. It's 11.30pm right now. And we have our sous chef right here sleeping on the job. It's my brick. You have not done a single ounce of work today. And we got Daniel here. If you're unfamiliar with Daniel, he's our third brother. Okay, so get your ass up. Come on, let's get this show on the road. We need to check out this hotel at 10am tomorrow morning. So we want to do this as quickly as possible. First things first, we need to get our ingredients, which I put in the the fridge there's a lot of ingredients that were not supposed to be in the fridge but i can't like i was so tired when i got back i wasn't bothered to like take everything out and be like oh cupboard fridge i was just fridge we don't really know exactly the step-by-step -step guide we're just gonna get a random recipe so this is what we're going for rustic italian pizza dough recipe video uh once again i'm just seeing a lot of words and it's vegan as well don't care all right just tell us the instructions okay we need to add the flour the yeast and the salt into a bowl they're not giving us any measurements you know nah, it does it's after just, bacon yeah i just... now understand the importance of measurements do you actually want to do it without measurements believe me okay fine what is that giant bowl we're actually making the biggest pizza in italy look put that over your head just so we can understand how big this is our first ingredient is, salt. let's check if we've got salt, sal, marino, fino. That is fine kitchen salt. Or oh, it's just the <laughs> kitchen on sale. This is the worst tutorial. So it says 600 milliliters of warm water. Stop. Do we have measuring stuff? We've got wine glass. Oh, we got a little one. Should we just use the smaller yeah, one? Yeah, yeah, Okay, we need 300 milliliters of water, yeah? Wine. This whole thing is one kilo, so we'll do half of it. That's half. Yeah, that's we need two to three tablespoons of fresh yeast. Wait, do we have fresh yeast or dried yeast? I'm gonna assume this is dried yeast. Is it powdery? Yeah. Okay, then I'm assuming if it's powdery, then it's dried yeast. Fresh would be in grains. I was gonna say liquid. Two teaspoons. 
What does that smell of? Mm, don't like that. It smells like cow it's food. Like so you got this much yeast, this much flour, and then how much of salt? I think it was one tablespoon. That looks like. Oh, your face, that is too much salt. Wait, wait, wait. Two tablespoons. Did I say tablespoons? Wait, wait, wait. Before you add it, teaspoons. One and a half teaspoons of salt. Okay, and then we need sugar. Why do we have sugar as well? Two teaspoons of sugar. Do we have sugar? We don't have sugar, mate. But look, do you know what we can do? We've got these sweets, and they have sugar on them. We grab one each. Try it. I think it's salt. Mmm, actually, Daniel. It could be sugar. I think it's Coca-Cola. It's sugar, man. It's sugar. We'll just put this in. We'll just rub them together like this. We're gonna make a fire. Say, so, ankles. Yeah, Alright, that's enough. That's enough sugar. Sprinkle the yeast into a medium bowl with the warm water. The water needs to be warm. Is it warm? <laughs> it's cool water. Just put it in the toaster. Three, two, one. We'll put it in the kettle for 10 seconds and it should become warm. Dude, I gotta set my inventory in. Oh. <laughs> It's still cold. It needs to go again. Round two, round two. We're gonna go over here. Wait, 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 wait. Is what? It, add the yeast into it, no? Yeah, the yeast is here. Yeah. Wait, add the yeast into what? The water? Sprinkle the yeast into a medium bowl with the warm water. Oh. Wait, but we added the yeast in there. We're done. They, they showed us the ingredients and we saw the ingredients list and we just started adding no, everything together. No, 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 Because the lady in the video, she put the yeast put in the Put this in the bowl. Do you know what the lady did? She mixed it up and then she poured the thing in slowly. Okay, we're going to pour the water in, Bonnet. Wait, wait, let's see the next step. Wait, 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 wait. Sprinkle the yeast into the medium bowl. Place almost all the flour on the table in the shape of a volcano. I think we're just going to put this into the crater of the volcano. Face us here creating Mount Vesuvius. You know that's a bit offensive. Why? Pompeii. Do you want to hear that? Cool. What? Let me just put this in the, in the crater. What do you call volcanoes that's if it, they got if they got paid by TikTok? TikTok creator fund. Okay, what do we do now? Mix. We have to no, mix, no, no, to mix it mix. with hand or mix no, it by... No, bro, we had to mix it with the thing. Wait, what do you mean? You know in the video, yeah. if you're following the video, she mixed it in whilst spinning it. Why did you say that now? I did. And you said bunny, let's just put the water in. Okay, do you do what you think we're supposed to do? Look at our pizza. So far. Are you excited, by the way? Not at the moment. Bro, this does not feel good. Yeah, because you, you're not done mixing it. You know what I clocked? The yeast is going to be only in one section. That's why we're meant to dissolve it in first. Actually, we're meant to dissolve it. There's going to be one section that just pops out and then the rest <laughs> of it is going to be normal. It's going to look like his parents are related. Wait, can you put it there, please? Ah. I, I want to look like I was doing something. How's that coming along? Should we start a new one? We still have half the flour left. Look, you do that bowl. I'm going to start a new one with That's the big bowl. That's fair. Don't leave me with the bomb one. Look, this should be easy. <laughs> We're going to add the yeast first. And then add the water. My question is, is it meant to be this sticky? Yeah, I think it is, but you know what? You're meant to... No, 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 no. Water makes it stickier. You're meant to add flour. Yeah, that's fine. Didn't help. No, do you know what you're meant to do? Put flour in this hand and scrape that off that hand with this hand. Put your hand on the ball. Now both of your hands are sticky. Yeah, that's hot. We'll just add cold water to it and it will balance out. This ball looks too big for this amount of yeast. We're going to dissolve the yeast in here. I'm just going to go like this and it should work. That looks so cool, look at that. It looks like mud water. No, as it in the mix. Like your look at your hands, gold. look at your hands. All right, all right. Okay, now okay. I'm gonna add the rest of the flour. Hey, and I'm gonna come and join you. Get there, Jane. <laughs> <laughs> you oh, I was meant to make a crater. Same. I was meant to make a volcano. It flopped from the start. You shouldn't have put in the water first. It doesn't matter. I got a bigger bowl. All right, I'll wash my hands quick. I'm wash your hands. <laughs> Get stuck in and dirty like a real man. That actually looks really good. Should we make different design pizzas? Make a pyramid pizza. This texture <laughs> does not feel good, bro. What's the tech? Is the technique like this? You you grip and twist. Grip and twist. No, it's more like this. <laughs> I'm catching up, mate. You know, I saw this um, lady on TikTok. Pretty sure she's Italian. <laughs> she made pasta. She was making dough. Oh, it looked so nice. How do you actually unstick it from your hand? Do you feel like it's getting less sticky on your hand? Nah, mate. It's <laughs> bonded, bro. It's in my skin fibers now. Look. Oh my <laughs> god. Do you know what you could do? I don't know. Do you know what I'm gonna do now? Okay, now what I want you to do is grab that spoon. There's four okay. hands here. This is the only usable hand right now. Let's scrape it off and put it here. <laughs> Just scrape it off. Like ice cream. Let's get in between the fingers. Uh, no, you're gonna <laughs> look at that dough. It actually feels lighter. I think I'm meant to make it into a ball now. This is not fun. I think it's quite fun, you know? Yeah, because you've got that fluff off your hand. You know what? I'm gonna put mine on this as well. 
Oh, this feels nice. Don't touch mine. I'm trying to replicate what I think that old lady was doing. She wasn't even old, she was just a lady. We need one of those rolly thingies as well. Rolly thingies? What are they called? Roller. It's a Wait. roller. Alright, that's your side of the shopping board. This is my side. So you can make the greatest dough. Who's needing technique is better? I'm doing no look. I'm doing look. Hey, should we just make our own pizzas? No, I'm taking a flap. What are you doing? Oh, this is like a baguette. Should I just make a baguette? This guy, bro. We're literally in France. I can't wait for the bakers to be in the comments. As a baker, I physically feel pain when I watch this video. This isn't bacon, we're cooking. Okay. What? Let him cook. You know we're meant to make them into balls. I'm trying to make them like, As so that there's no part cracks. He's finishing my sentences. Wait, say that again. He's finishing my, my sentences. Ah! Mine's a bit sticky. Is it meant to have like a bit of stickiness? <laughs> The quality of this guy's man. Sure. They can't. Oh, you can make the coolest shape. I made dinosaur egg. I mean, I don't know what this is. That's like cow's tongue, bro. Ah, look. <sighs> he thinks he's sick. I made this thing. Okay, I'll add for all of us. Do that. Bro is hungry. Bro is hungry. How long are we supposed to do this for? Until it's a board, I guess. This is the wrong technique, isn't it? <laughs> I come to find me. Oh, you try to do it around the world. Okay, not, not quite. But look, mine's... You have to like you know the consistency it's meant to be. I just want to make the pizza now. But you know I'm still going off that one video. <laughs> that lady that oh did my. the worst tutorial she on the bread. internet. She, she was literally like... Make bread. You need to make a pizza. And... Don't forget your topping. <laughs> don't forget to eat. Let me feel the texture of yours. No, this no, is no, actually... Don't I want to bang Okay, I'm going to cover mine. Wait, no, no, no. You meant to cut... Right. Wait, don't you have to cover after putting or adding olive oil? No, it doesn't say olive oil. Oh, no, no, no. It says grease up a bowl with some olive oil and put the dough inside. You don't grease up the dough. Guys, we've encountered a problem. Why does it say cover the bowl and put the, so the dough aside to let rest for four to five hours? That's just not happening. It's <laughs> half past midnight right now. Just so it gets bigger. Come on now. Just, just put mine on top of yours. Cover the bowl and put the... I don't know what I'm doing. It just feels <laughs> funny. Preheat the oven. So, do you, do you care to explain what you're doing here? Jokes aside, mine actually like, I mean, good weight. What's a good weight? 200 <laughs> LBs. Why does mine have oil on here? The real, I give you... Why are you adding more oil? So how long should we actually cover it for? Till it starts sweating. You know, I saw the, the lady do actually on, t on the TikTok video. I think she made it long like this and then she braided it. So it went like that and then she went... <laughs> and then you, she merged it together. Yeah, that kind of worked. I'm actually sweating, bro. Oh, we have to leave it for five hours. We need to leave it until checkout. Cook in the airport. Dude, is this even an oven, bro? Do you want to see the interior? Oi, what if we don't have an oven? It looks very microwavy. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. This is not oven. Bro, this is not oven. <laughs> face on, face on. All jokes aside, this is not oven. Can you cook dough on the stove? Nah, I see. Oh, no. Oh, damn. <laughs> Bro, this is not oven. This is a microwave. This is a full-on microwave. Can you microwave? Just... No, because we're, we're starving. It's half midnight. We've barely eaten all day. We're going to do something. We need to make something from this. Flip, man. Wait, let me see. Can you fry dough? Guys, apparently you can fry dough. Really? Yeah. Fried dough made in 15 minutes. Okay, step one, making the dough. Flour, baking powder, salt, and sugar. We added all those things except for baking powder. So instead of baking powder, we did yeast. Does that do a big difference? None of us know how bacon works. Oh, you, I think there's baking powder in there. I'm just going to add baking powder to my one. One of them, I think, is baking powder. Is it that? No, that's flour. <gasps> that's baking powder. Oh, God. How do we not have an oven? Okay, we're making fried pizza. How much baking powder am I supposed to add? I don't know, man. I can't at this point. That's on you. Why does it look like shards of glass? Okay, I'm going to try and merge it all together. Oh, yeah, it feels a lot better than it did before, though. I think it was the... Just Bread. Fried pizza. I don't know how this was going to turn out. Okay, it's not working. Oh, yeah, it stinks of gas. Guys, we're going to do fried pizza. I need to chop these onions. Okay, let me let me carry on doing it in here and you chop. Wait, let's clean the chopping board, bro. We don't flour on the onions. So we're going to do it by sections. So we're starting bottom left. Okay, that's enough, that's enough. Yeah, there we go. Next side. This is actually a whole operation just to clean the chopping board. Why is it this big? Please, I've to watch out. Alright, that should be fine. Alright, onion. Do you want to chop it? Wait, where did you go? Hey Siri, how do you say onion in Italian? In Italian, onion is cipolla. Cipolla. Go on, son. El cipolla. <laughs> 
awesome. This is gonna take a half an hour to make the sauce, by the way. To make the sauce is gonna take a half an hour? Why? We're gonna fry the onions. Where'd you find the bowls? The bowl. The bowl over here. Here you go. Okay, so now we're making the sauce for the pizza. It's gonna have onions, tomato paste, it's called ricotta, oregano. Look, why did you splash that everywhere? Okay, we're waiting for the onions to heat up. Wait till they become soft. Add the tomato paste. Thanks. Add some salt. What's the most Italian thing you know? <laughs> this is the ugliest pan I've seen. In oh, why is the floor soaked? This is uh, the wrong tomato paste. Why is it orange? Why didn't you add all of it? Yeah, just dump the whole thing. We have nothing to lose. We're making fried pizza. All right, we're adding, what's, what are you adding? Salt. Oregano. Just don't know how much we're doing. Yeah, that actually looks nice. The fried pizza cannot wait. Give it a little mix. Have it on low heat. Let it simmer. It's gonna add a bit more salt. Why? Did you taste it? Nah. So why do you want to add more salt? Close that smells so nice. Daniel, you give us a taste. I can't lie. It actually tastes like... Sauce. <laughs> <laughs> So now we just need to wait until the whole thing comes together. It's burning. Oh, this might be good, you know. I'm sad. We don't have our oven. Topping number one is this cheese. It's the grand mix. So that was going in this bowl. Oh, this, this is going to look like a proper like pizza shop <laughs> with no oven. We got the grand mix classico. This, this is, I think this is the nicest cheese I've ever smelled in my life. Like oh my bombing. God. Oh my. This tastes like parmesan. Spinach. Oh, you? Nah, I'm actually very proud. Oh, it's great. I've never made dough in my life. Oh yeah. I wish this was like macaroons. I don't know if you saw the video, but there's a part where it's like, if your meringue is of the right quality, you can put it over your head and it doesn't fall. And that's my dough right now. Except it's not mer- Put that. Because it's not going to fall. Face up, face up, face up, face up, face You have to catch it. But no, no, put your hand lower. No. This is Italian bowling. Why is it not falling? Let's actually get frying, mate. Yeah, let's get frying. I got an idea. I actually got an idea. Make it into a tube. Yeah. Make it into a tube, yeah? Like that. Oh, I think we need more flour. I can't lie. That feels very yeah, flour so need worthy. Just... And then we grab one section of it. Cut it. Really nice. Really smooth. And make sure you go through all of it like that. Now we have like this tiny section. This is what we're going to turn into the pizza. We'll try it with this one, yeah? Alright, look at that. You want to gently pull it out as well. I don't know why. I'm just trying to go off memory from what I've seen in pizza movies. Oh, I wish we had like a rolly thing. Rolly, rolly, rolly. rolly. You know what we can use? Pringles. I'm gonna add some flour, make sure it doesn't stick. Then we get the Pringles tube and we just gently. Okay, guys, so this. Wait, what's the flick thing they do? I said they go like this. <laughs> that ruined it. <laughs> it's got belly button up. So do we, do we fry this first and then we add the toppings on top? Do you think? I'm asking, I don't know. I'm gonna give this a go. First fried pizza on the menu today. We're gonna add some olive oil. I'm assuming it needs to be on high heat. Do you know what I think we can do? We'll fry it for a bit, flip it over, fry it again. Flip then... it over? Put all the toppings on it. No, 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 that's what I'm saying. Fry just the dough, yeah. flip it over, oh, fry yeah, it, yeah. and then we add the toppings as it's cooking. Right, it. Anyways, this is the shape. You ready? Three, two, one. What do you think is going to happen before Three. I put it in? Okay, I'll put it in. Whoa. That was crazy. <laughs> We're frying dough. <laughs> right, flip it over. It looks like chapati. We actually made chapati. It's such a pay. <laughs> that was hard. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You can Emmy, 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 Emmy. Oh, this is Chapati. <laughs> Bro, we made Chapati. Okay, I think another thing we did wrong was added too much oil. With our trial run, we've learned two things. One, we're not making pizza, we're making Chapati. Two, we don't need to use oil because it's just too much. And wait, I said two things in it. Yeah, that's it. You know, if we give this to an Italian person, I think we'll get rushed. No, they'll spit at us. They can hold that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to start doing my toppings. We're going to get some tomato sauce and put that here. Of course, you need to do the little circular motion. Why are you jogging me? And then we're gonna add some cheese as well. Some cheese here. We're gonna add a tomato. We're gonna get some spinach as well. I don't even know what the title is gonna be. I think it's just gonna be, we tried to make pizza in Italy. And then I wanna add the final dash of this cheese. This is the best smelling cheese ever. All right, let's see. Put it on, dude. So this, why did you get a smidgen? Of, I'm taking this off. You ruined it. Okay, so this is what I actually got. This is um, what we've conjured up today. The toppings, we've got ricotta. And we've got some tomatoes, some spinach. No, we actually got three different types of cheese in total. Take oh, yeah. Guys, picture time. Um, I'm going to take a picture of this. Follow me on Insta if you want to see the result. And me. So what's your Insta face off? Oh, I cooked pizza without an oven. All right, Daniel, you ready? It's the cutting process now. We want to cut it into three. Let's go one, two. All right, there we go. We got our three pieces. All right, so Daniel's trying to find the right ambiance for us trying the food. What well, have you searched up? Restaurant ambience. For how long? 10 hours. You know, this YouTube video is longer than our checkout time. No, we just left the front door open, so anyone can just walk in right now.
much. Oh. Round of applause, guys. I'm seeing. Oh, no, oh. for real. This is great. All right, how's your one coming along, mate? Oh, look at that. All right, so you've actually given your one edges. Did you use eco style? Oh, I didn't have tuna on mine. Uh, tuna. What are you doing with the tuna? Draining the oil. That tuna looks nice. Oh, this pizza is actually great, mate. It's not pizza. <laughs> it's not pizza. How do you say tomato? Tomatisha. Tomate. What's your favorite Italian word on this trip so far? Scusi, scusi, scusa. Scusi. What's yours, Daniel? Restaurante. Look at that. Do you think these videos are as funny for other people as they are for us? Mm, I, I think it's funny in different funny. ways. So I think we just, we find it entertaining in the moment. But there's a lot of things that happen in these videos that I would cut out because they're just not funny to an audience. Like that, what you just did now, you lot are never going to see it because no one's going to find out funny. How do you? You know. Can you talk us through what you're doing? This guy just does oh, stuff. So he thinks it's like a quiet what? video. It's because I'm excited. <laughs> Why are you putting it in for 15 minutes? How long are we going to put this in here for? Until it melts. These never ended up getting used in the end. <laughs> Should we breastfeed them? Look at that! Oh, look at that, mate. Delicate, classy, insubordinate. That looks very pizza like. Picture time! Dude, I gotta, I gotta take a freaking snapshot. What are we saying? Some adjectives, please. What are your thoughts? I actually really like them. The sauce is really nice. I compliments the tuna well. Two slices left. So have this one. Please, this is not cooked on the inside, mate. Yeah, that's not cooked, mate. I think the outside's got cooked, but the inside didn't. Oh, I wonder why. Probably linked to. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba. some stuffed crust with the cheese that I've fallen in love with. So I'm assuming you just go around the sides like this, just put cheese everywhere basically along the edges. We'll add some of this cheese as well. So as you can see, a lot of cheese. And then I think we're just gonna engulf the cheese into it like this. In the cheese and then quickly add the sauce on. Then some more cheese. I'm gonna add the rest of this on. Tomato, add this cheese on top as well. Spinach. There we go, look at that. Tuna, forgot the tuna. I think that's everything. How do I add this on? Okay, I didn't think this through. I'll just make it like this. No, please don't break, please don't break, please don't break, please don't break. I was just gonna leave it for five minutes and we'll get- No, I was meant to cook that first and then- It's fine. I'm gonna leave that five minutes. I'm gonna come back to it. All right, pizza's almost done. I actually flipped it um, off camera. I'm gonna flip it back and we'll see what the stuffed crust pizza looks like. You ready? Oh my god! Wait. Look at oh. that! That looks amazing. I think it needs a few more minutes. So we're gonna just flip it back and leave it there for, a, for another three minutes. Look at that, mate. And you know what's cool? If you look inside the crust, look at that. Does it look cheesy? No, not really. Oh no, it's meant to look cheesy. But yeah, this is our final product. I'm sure it tastes exactly the same as the other ones, but it's just different shape. Outro, okay. We finished, we did the intro, we got through that. Now it's the outro part. Hope you enjoyed watching this video, bye. Daniel, come. Last review on the, on the food. I can't lie, it did not turn out as bad as well. We thought it would be, but we made the best out of the worst situation. If there's one thing we learned, because I feel like we need to always have a lesson at the end of. I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> Let me get some pizza.